There's no trail markers or anything here, so I'm just following the nose. This is hard bloody work. I am completely lost. Oh, charming. Same to you, pal. Buenos dias, amigos. It's a hot, sticky, sweaty, dusty day here in San Salvador. A perfect day, I think, for getting out of the city and up onto some volcanoes. First thing I need to do is find the trailhead. I've already walked halfway across the city today because I couldn't work out how the buses work. And as you can see, for pedestrians, it's not very easy either. And here we go guys, it's a relief to get out of the city. Oh, so we're already at 930 meters altitude, we're going to be heading up to around 2000 to the summit of Mount Pikachu. No that's not a Pokemon character, that's a real mountain. Already gone the wrong way once. I was heading over that direction. Should be heading over here. Okay, helpful lady pointing me the right way. Feels like we're on the trail now properly. We're under the canopy, which is a relief. Oh, it's really hot. The good news is, the higher we climb, the cooler it's gonna get. Bad news is, we've got to climb it first. sides of this banana. Bet you wish yours was as big as that, don't you? Don't we all? Hey guys, you see like a very simple farm there. It's a bit of corrugated iron and a washing line. People whose lives must have not changed in decades. And then look at that view of the city. Pretty cool. Couple of birds of prey there, no doubt checking me out. You can see quite cloudy there on the summit, guys. Wow, my face is bright red. Wow, ah, this is wild. Put some bug spray onto my forehead and uh, just sweat, and it's just dripped right into my eyes. It's hard going. Quite a bit of bushwhacking going on now as well. There are some pine trees up there which uh, indicates it's going to get cooler. There's a nice breeze now as well. It is the middle of the day, probably not the best time to have started a hike. But it's only going to get cooler. Just got to keep on moving. Lunchtime. On the menu today we have pupusas. And the lady gave me some, uh, I guess that's some hot sauce, some pickles to go with it. I don't know how I'm going to uh, manage to get them onto there without making a mess, but and 
for dessert we've got some papaya. Fair bit of bushwhacking going on there guys, I couldn't really film anything. I'm pleased to say it's turned into more of a pine forest now than a jungle. Take a look at this. We've still got those views over the city over there. If a lot of it's like this then uh, there'll be plenty of places to camp. I'd have just spotted a horse over there, eyeing me up. Oh, charming. Same to you, pal. Well, the pine forest didn't last too long. Back in the jungle now. Walked through a million cobwebs. I dread to think the size of the tarantulas that spun those webs. There's no, uh, there's no one. There's no trail markers or anything here, so I'm just following the nose, hoping for the best. Yeah, it's definitely cooled off a bit though, so I'll take that as a win. I haven't done any research into what kind of wildlife is living here, snakes or whatever. I didn't want to freak myself out. Plenty of bird life as you can hear. It's mostly heard and not seen though. Apart from the vultures that seem to be uh, circling overhead constantly. Well guys. The trail has led me here. The trail was over there somewhere. And I don't know. I've got to get over there somehow, but the trail just seems to have disappeared. This is hard bloody work. It feels like the birds are laughing at me as well. Folks, I am completely lost. I'm going to have to go for a plan B here and uh, head back where we came and head to a different volcano, El Bocadon, which is the, uh, the vol Vulcan of uh, San Salvador. That's a more touristy one with better trails, so uh, hopefully we can't get lost, but I need to find the way to the trailhead to that one first. How the hell do I get out of here? started to rain. Feels really nice at the moment. So if it's a passing shower uh, on the weather forecast. Uh, the, weather for, the weather forecast is for scattered thunderstorms so oh here we go another <laughs> this way or this way. Oh. I'll have to put the camera away and have a look. But uh, yeah, scattered thunderstorms were forecast, so let's hope that doesn't come to pass. If I'm camping tonight, it might be a long night. Well guys, we're on the main road. This is where we head to get to El Boqueron, volcano number two. That one's uh, a more popular sort of touristy place. So there's uh, like an entrance and uh, kiosk and stuff like that. 
So whether I'm going to be able to get up there and camp tonight, I don't know, but uh, in a cute little cemetery. We'll give it a go. We'll see what happens. It's probably not the weather for camping anyway. It doesn't really matter. I'm soaked as it is, but... <laughs> We'll see what happens here. And over there in the distance, that one's Pikachu. That's where we were headed. How the hell would have got there? I don't know. If for some strange reason you ever watch this and decide you want to go up Pikachu, I think hiring a guide is the way to go. tipping it down again guys I got excited there I saw that sign for a hostel and I thought yeah I could stay at the hostel tonight turns out it's up the road there hola la puedo esperar aquí que pase, que pase la lluvia ya sé <laughs> yesterday it said it was going to rain it didn't the day before it said it was going to rain it didn't today it said it was going to rain it has and big time Volcano Quest was a fail. Um, 